last Monday in something that has become way too often in our land, the people of Ambazonia were once again reminded of the absolute horror under which we live in the land of our birth. Lives were taken senselessly in brutish fashion by an army of occupation that view our people as lambs to be slaughtered. Of course, they view us as lambs because for more than 56 years, they have brought horror and terror to our land and been able to go back to their homeland with praise and the loot they have stolen from our people. Enough. Enough. The right to self-defense is as instinctive to a human being as the air we breathe. No people, no nation can unilaterally disarm, especially in the face of an occupation whose brutality and impunity causes the streets of our towns and villages to be soaked with the blood of innocence. In a moment, I will be signing an order authorizing the Ambazonian Defense Force to begin the great and noble task of protect, protecting our defenseless people and freeing our land from this long nightmare that is our occupation by La Republique du Cameroon. In doing this, let me paraphrase. In doing this, we declare our right on this earth to be a human being, to be respected as a human being, to secure the rights of a human being in this society, on this earth, in this day, which we intend to bring using every means at our disposal. May God bless our men and women now on the march in the field. May he bless our land, Ambazonia. Thank you.